welcome to Disney Makes Coloring. If you're new here, my name is Megan and I'm so excited to be here with you today. So for today's video, I am going to be setting up my coloring journal for the month of February. I cannot believe it's just a few days away. Um, I'm actually filming this a little bit ahead of time because um, I'm already starting to schedule buddy colors and everything and I need to get better at keeping track because um, when I'm filming this, I have five days left for the month and I just realized that I did not write down three buddy colors that I committed to and so that adds, so I need to get on the ball. Anyway, so I'm going to do this ahead of time. So in case you didn't know, this is my coloring journal if you're new here. I have a whole video of um, setting it up for 2023. Um, I have lots of videos. Um, I will put links to those videos in the description box below. If I do remember, I might even put the 2023 setup in the eye in the sky here. So here is my book that we will be setting up. And then I have some supplies. So for my pens, I'm going to use, these are my Erin Condren dual tip um, markers. They have a they call this the medium tip on one end and fine tip on the other. I, am, I tend to use the fine tip mostly. So I'm using a light pink and a dark pink. So those are my colors I'm going to be using to write with. Um, the washi tapes I chose, which I might not use all of them. Um, I am going to line the edges with this red and white heart washi tape. It's just... I believe it's from Michael's and then I have these th four are from um, XO Mama Plans um, she has her own shop this one says love all around it um, this one has I don't know if you can see it, it has hearts and Minnie Mouse bows and Mickey heads and then this one, instead of conversation hearts, it's conversation Mickeys. And then this one is a pink ombre and it's got Mickey heads and hearts all over it and silver foiling. So those are the ones that I chose. And then I pulled a whole bunch of stickers that I thought I'd show, show you. Now I don't, I've had these for a long time, so I don't know if they're still available out there. Some of these I got on Etsy. Um, some of them I've gotten um, at the Dollar Tree. I've gotten at Michael's. This is from a shop on Etsy called Lisa Lauren Lorene Plans. And it's little, I'm gonna zoom you in so you can see it. They're little sloths with hearts. This one is from Scribble Prints Co. They have their own shop now, not on Etsy. Um, I don't I don't know if she sells these types of anymore, but these were her doodle people, and you could choose their hair color and skin color. And this is her Valentine's one. This is from Glam Planner. I used to have a subscription, and so every month I would get I forget what they're called. They had a name for her characters. Oh, what were they called? Oh, I'm drawing a blank. Anyway, I had a subscription and I would get the stickers to go with that. So those were the Valentine's Girls. These were ones, um, Fox and Pip was what they were called. And I own the digital, I don't know if it's called a digital stamp or whatever. So I made my own sticker sheets. They're really tiny. So it's a blonde girl holding a string of hearts. Um, this one are leftovers from a Valentine sticker kit that I used in one of my Erin uh, Condren planners. Here are some penguins with hearts. And this one is from A Heartfelt Life. I got those on Etsy. Um, these are from Coffee Monsters Co. They are, I they may have their own website now. I don't know. I haven't shopped for a really long time for stickers. But when I got these, I believe I got them on Etsy. This is their Valentine's Day emojis. And then 
This is from Pookie Bear Cuties. It's just little girls with pink hair. Valentine's um, ones. Then this is from a Happy Planner. We're going to zoom back out. There we go. This is from a Happy Planner book. Holidays is what it's called. Me and My Big Idea is one of their sticker books. So this was the Valentine's Day sheet. Um, I made a Happy Planner into a sticker album. So I would put all my sticker sheets, and these are all from Michael's. So these are, look like stamps. And then on the back side, there's some colorful uh, iridescent hearts and some conversation hearts. And here are just some red and pink hearts. And then here's some red glittery ones that I won't use because they are falling off. Um, the sticky is gone. They're really, really old. These ones are actually lifted, so they're raised off the paper. So I probably won't use those because it won't make the I won't be able to write in there. But those are really cute hearts. This was in I got a scrapbooking calendar one year. I couldn't tell you what year, but um, it had a sticker f sheet for every three days. And then here's some red foiled hearts. And then these are raised up little mason jars, but yeah. And then this is, was, um, I think I got this from the Dollar Tree a long time ago. Anyway, it can't, I had a bunch of sheets. They're all the same. I had three or four sheets of it. And then this one is, I believe from the Dollar Tree. If not the Dollar Tree, then the Dollar Spot at Target. These are cardboard stickers. And these are all Valentine's -y. But yeah, they're called Love. The Love stickers. But yeah, I just pulled those. Not sure if I'm going to use any of them. But there they are. So what we're going to start with. So I'm going to get my washi cutter out. If you don't know, I use a palette knife. So I'm going to start with this side. Um, I'm not going to show my stats from last month. Um, I'm going to show you those on my completed pages. So I'm going to do a few pages with you on camera, and then I am going to do the rest off camera, and I will, if I can get this washi tape to work. Just so you know, if you don't use your washi tape, it doesn't always work. And if it's a cheapy one, they tear really easy. Like that. See how it just tore. So, I'm not sure. We might have to switch. Let's see. What we can do here. See, it's like already... not wanting to work you, oh see I don't know if we're gonna be able to use this I want to use it I do I do I do yep so this one's not gonna work <laughs> I don't want to mess with it I am bummed let me see. I have others I can go pull. Here is a red Mickey one. I don't like to use my Mickey Mouse ones on the outside. But I could. Because you do use a lot. So I could use this one. So maybe I will use the heart Mickey one. This is better washi tape. It's not cheapy washi tape anyway. So we are going to turn our book. So I just line this up as best I can. And I press it down. I go to the very last dot and I rip it. We're going to rip this one on this side, the very last dot. And then we're going to flip the page over and fold it 
over the top. Voila, we're gonna do one more. Don't wanna waste any. Press it down, make sure you press it down because it will come back up. And then tear it, flip it over, and fold the washi tape over. And there. So I'm gonna do the rest off camera and I will be right right back. All right, so um, I learned that the dots on these pages are not even. So if they don't look straight, I went by the dots, that is why. So I do apologize for that. Um, so I, I do 10 pages. That is um, for now what I'm doing. I did 10 for January, so I have 10 for February. So we're going to start with our calendar. And I am going to... I was thinking of using this to make the calendar. But I'm going to grab a pencil. I had one. Aha. Here it is. Here's my handy dandy. These are my favorite pencils. If you're looking for pencils, I really like these. These are the Paper Mates. Um, I have tons of them. They're my favorite. The point. This one's point seven. I don't think I pay attention to the point. Anyway, they're my favorite. So I do um, a dot, and then I count down to four, and then another dot. So I'm going to pull up my handy dandy calendar here on my computer. And so it starts on a Wednesday. So we have four, four weeks. So we'll start. So we're going to start here. One, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. That's two weeks, one, two, three, one, two, three, four, and then we will go this way. One, two, three, four, one, two, three. So a Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. So we did Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday is the first. So we're going to go up one, two, three. So we do a dot there. One, two, three, four. A dot there. And a dot there. Now I was thinking I could do the washi tape, but I don't know if I want to. Because I mean, it's so cute to outline my calendar. I don't think I'm gonna do it. I don't think so. We're gonna do it this way. And then go here and here. I'd like to do it with my pencil in case I make a mistake. It does happen. I am not perfect. Um, I am a perfectionist, but I'm not perfect. So I like things to be perfect, which is why I do it in pencil first. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do the dots in the darker pink and the lines in the lighter pink. What do you guys think? Like you, you can't really talk to me. Sad, sad day. And then I will do the numbers in the darker pink. Let's see. So I, wanna, I can't zoom you in too far. You can't see the whole thing. I don't want to move it around. So how's everybody been? 
did you all have, by the time you see this, it will be Monday. Did you all have a good weekend? Um, I couldn't tell you because I haven't had my weekend yet. I'm hoping to color, color, color all weekend. I don't know how I did it. Um, I did not do any Advent books this month, but I did take two vacations, and that really does take some time away. So, again, um, I am way behind. So now I'm just doing lines in between the dots. Like so. So... So on the three dots, um, I prefer the dot grid in my books than lined because I feel like you have more freedom, um, but the dots do help keeping things lined up, which I do like. Um, so like if I draw in here, which someday I'll, I'll have to draw with you guys. Um, it might be something sped up because it does take me quite a bit. I do a lot of erasing. I'm going back until I for sure like it. But, but yeah. So I was wondering in the comments below if you guys could help me figure out. I am looking for some new TV shows to binge watch. Um, let me tell you some that I have watched. I'm a huge Grey's Anatomy fan. I've watched that one multiple times. Though I'm not caught up. I have a really hard time with the newer seasons. I miss all the original cast a lot. Um, I've watched Criminal Minds, I've watched NCIS, I've watched Bones, I have watched, I was going to try something, but I want to figure out which pink I want to try. So I'm going to try something with a highlighter. So this one is really bright. This one is more purpley. Didn't want that. This one is kind of a darker pink. I think we're going to use this one. Let's see how it works. So I'm going to write February with this. So these are zebra fine liners and you had the, this is the fine tip and then you had the chisel tip. I'm using the fine tip to write February. Feb. Rue. Way. We. And then what I was going to do is with a black pen which I have, I will just use my Erin Condren, my black one, with the fine tip. I'm going to take my pen and I am going to just kind of, um, kind of bring out the lines a little bit more, like so. I don't know if you guys can see that. Let me zoom you in so you can see it. I did that. I don't know if you can see that. Just for something different. Thought that would be fun. But. So yeah. So with my dark pink. I'm going to write the numbers in. And the days. So. Here we have Sunday. Monday. Tuesday. Uh-oh, I did it wrong. See, you do make mistakes. Thursday, Friday, Saturday. So the first of the month is actually here. 
Okay, well, so February went into the month. <laughs> That's okay. That's okay, February. We'll forgive you. So my dough needs to go up here, and I need my handy dandy whiteout, which I have. I use the Tombow Mono Correction Tape is my favorite. If you are a planner person, these are very popular in the planner community, which I am was a part of before I found this coloring community. Right? Yes. Seven, eight. Valentine's Day is on a Tuesday. Six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight. Okay, so I have extra. I was gonna see what I have here in these stickers. I could go over it with washi tape to correct it. So we're gonna use our correction tape. And then Should we put some washi underneath? Should we do stickers? You never know. This sticker has these little, um, I like them, uh, tabs. So just for February, I wanted to use one just to see if I like it. I'm thinking I'm gonna use the hugs and kisses one. So to mark our loving February, we're gonna put this in the very edge because I really don't want it to stick up. I don't know if that's going to work. There. Ta-da! So it has a little tab. So cute. Alright. We can sticker it up. Or um, what should we do? What should we do? What to do? What to do? Kind of like these a lot, but I didn't use any red. This isn't going to work. It doesn't want to stick. They are old. Oh, I know. I know. I know. I know. I know what I could do. We're going to do the top. So that way it's not sticking to the washi tape. Because I think that's the problem. Is it doesn't want to stick. Of course, it's not wanting to stick to the paper. They are old, like I said, and I believe they were from the Dollar Tree. But, um... Let's see, these are all like squared stickers. I think I'm gonna do this. So I wanna use this conversation Mickey's. I'm gonna do it right here. Cut it off there. Sorry, I feel like I'm being very scatterbrained this time around. And I think I'm just gonna do some heart stickers. I have some of those. Let's see, do we want these hearts? Well, I think I want these ones. They got like patches on them and things. They're so very, very cute. Sorry, I'm like blocking. We're just gonna stick some, 
some hearts down the side. So very cute. This one says love. I need one more. One more. This one. Just to go right there. There, it's so very cute. I don't know. Eh. Kind of looks like Mod Podge. It's not what my journals used to look like. I need to pull those out one time. I should do an old uh, bullet journal is what they're called. So we're going to move along. <laughs> Moving along. Moving my stickers out of my way. Okay. So next what I do is my completed pages. So... With this here, it kind of is in the way. So I'm going to write nice and big. Completed. Completed. Pages. Dot, 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 dot. Okay. So we're going to start with our hidden Mickey box. And then we're going to start with the book. Can you guys even see what I'm doing? Yeah. How many pages? The medium. Oops. Mediums. Look, at, I can't even write. And the date. So we have book, we're gonna underline pages, medium, and date. So I like to number them, but we're gonna put the square first. So I'm just gonna do this first page with you, and then I'm gonna finish the rest of the pages off camera, and we'll come back and fill out the rest of my journal for you together so we have one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven so there we go so that's what it's going to look like. And then I will write my books and stuff with the lighter color. So there's some contrast. So I'm going to continue on. Um, last month I did up to 80. <laughs> but so far, um, as you can see, I've colored a lot. But when I color multiples in one book, I write it all on one line. So... But the month's not over, like I said, so you never know. So I'm going to finish the rest of these, and I will be back. Okay, so what I did was I continued. I'm going to zoom you out just a hair so you, I don't have to keep moving the book. So I just did one. I did two full pages, and then I did this half a page. I'm going to leave this one blank in case I have more. Um, I'm going to try not to stress myself out this next month like I have been. So now we're going to turn our book the right way. And sorry, I write crooked. I know, I'm so sorry. So for this one, we are going to do buddy colors. So we are going to write buddy colors. And I don't know why I like my dots, but I do. And then what I do as I do a box at the beginning, and then I'm gonna number them, so it'll be one. And then um, I do a box at the very end. So, the reason I have two boxes, for those of you who are new, I know I explain this every month for my returnees, but this is to mark that I colored it, this box. This box on here is to mark that I posted it on Instagram. 
or Facebook or wherever I need to post it. So how I do it, I'm doing that in case you're new that come. I write, so I'm going to start off with um, the person's name. So I know I have a buddy color with Amanda. And then I do her um, Instagram, and which is Amanda dot colors and we do we're doing one out of the coloring haven heaven strawberry shortcake cake book and then that was a long title, but normally I could fit it, fit it all in one line. And then the page we're doing is the Lemon Meringue page. I'm just going to put Lemon Meringue because I don't know how to spell it. And I don't want to spell it wrong on camera here. So then I skip a line here. And then I will put my next one, number two. And then for this one... um. Instead of writing the name, because I, I do it with multiple people. Actually, no, I'm going to write both of their names. So this one is with Amanda also. At Amanda. Dot colors. And Jamie. From at. Jamie. Loves. I don't know why I'm drawing a blank. It's Jamie Loves Coloring. Colors, coloring. I will tell you. Give me one second. Jamie's Coloring Love. Look at me. Jamie's. That's it. My brain does not want to work. Coloring. Love. And by the way, these pens do not like to write over the correction tape. And then the book that we do is we are coloring an ivy and the inky butterfly. And I'm not going to write the page down because I know it's the next two pages. So then I skip a line and do my next box for number three, you know, so on, so on, so on. So there it is. So I am going to do these two pages and these two pages. So at the top of this one, all right, buddy colors continued. So that will be the next two pages. So the next I make room, um, this one is for Challenges and prompts. Right. Challenges and prompts. And then for that one, I just do a box here, and that's to show that I completed it. And then I will write, I am numbering these two because it helps with my end um, when I do my wrap up at the end of the month. So um, let's start with, um, I want to write myself and at amanda.colors. And then the hashtag, I try to write on the top two, which is frogs and friends. It's not going to fit. Color along. <laughs> it didn't fit. And then it is, the page we're doing is the, um, oh, it was way cute. 
Anyway, I write what the page is. I'm so sorry that my brain is just not working tonight. And so this is to check it off that I completed it. So I'm going to leave an, a blank space. And then I'm going to do my next one. And I will do my, my challenge. So it's at Disney... I don't really need to write this, but I'm just showing you guys. Disney Meg's coloring. And it is hashtag Meg's ABC color challenge 2023. And the letter is L. And then I'll go on as I find them. So here would be three, and then so on and so on and so on. But I, I don't fill that out with you guys. I just want you to know how I do them. So I will leave myself, I'll leave four pages with that. So on this side, we will do challenges and prompts continued. Prompts continued, dot, 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 dot. So that's four pages for that. So, and then this one is, I like to print out, I belong to Danny Button's Patreon. And she does a bingo um, every month. I haven't been good at participating yet, but it is one of my goals for this year. So we are going to write at the top, Danny Button's Bingo. Danny buttons bingo and then I print it off and I stick it here so that I can mark them off as I do them and then we will start our notes pages so this is notes and for notes since I have all this such cute washi tape think Nah, I'm not going to. I think I'm going to do stickers. Stickers! We're going to find the... I'll just keep using these that we used. We're going to do them all along the top. I have a much better way of storing my stickers, so you guys know then in uh, Happy Planner Rings. Um, so if you'd ever want to see that, let me know. I'm more than willing to show you my sticker storage. It's so cute. So there we go. Notes. And then we're going to do, we have two more notes pages. We got notes. And it's, we will do some more stickers. I need to use these up anyway. The ones on the back are falling off. Oh, this one's cute. This one says, love. I really like this patchwork one. It's a glittery one. Will it stick on the paper? It just might. And then I need a small one. So well, these do stick on the paper. They just don't stick on the sticky stuff back here. They're cute. I like them. We're just gonna put them. It's probably the only places. Well, no, we could put them since they're falling off back here. We could put them up here. Might as well use them up. 
right? Oh, and I had to take the tab thing off. I don't know if you guys noticed. It fell off while I was doing the completed pages. It did not want to stick. So let me know. All right, so what we're gonna do now is our February wrap up. We're gonna do this fun the way like I did February before. We're gonna do, start over here. Feb, Ru, We, Re, 2023. With my black pen, I'm going to accentuate these letters. I don't know how else to say what it, it is. Um, I love doing lettering. It's one of uh, another things. I need to show you guys some of my bullet journals. Let me know in the comments below if you would be interested in seeing a bullet journal video. I don't keep it now. I do this instead, but one of my old ones. So first we do our videos. And then I have the calendar pulled up. Where did you go? So we do every Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday. So our first ones are going to be one, two, and one, three. So we have one, two, one, three, one, six, one, seven, and then one, nine, one, ten. I might be changing it up. Um, I'm having a hard time keeping up with the videos. These clips close together. I might instead do Sunday, Monday, and then Thursday, Friday. We shall see. Because I know I said I don't work, but I kind of technically do. Um, I'm a nanny three days a week. So on those three days, I have a hard time. It happens to be Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. So... I try to get, yeah, uh, what I would love to do is do film all my videos over the weekend, edit them, have them ready to go and schedule to come out. So far that hasn't happened. <laughs> but like I said, going on vacation and I've done it twice this month, totally throws a loop in things. So February, I don't think we're going anywhere at all. So maybe I can get in a routine. Anyway, I'm blabbing. Sorry. So we got one. 13 and 1. I'm saying 1. You guys aren't correcting me. It's February. We're in 2. 2, 2, 2, 2, 2, 14. 2, 16 and 17. And then 2, 19 and no. to 20 and 21. And we have two, 23 and 24. And then we have 27 and 28. So, and then as you guys know, every Thursday, I am doing a color along on some page that has to do with my letter for the month. And so for um, this coming Thursday's video on the second, this one, it is going to be, I'll write it here. It's going to be my L um, color along. And it is the Alice in Wonderland. It's the Disney ABC ABC book. 
So we're doing the L page. It's the Alice in Wonderland one for being late. It's the white rabbit holding his watch. He's late, he's late, he's late. And then at the end of each Thursday, I will show what I'm going to be coloring the next Thursday. So in case you guys want to color along with me if you have those books. So I'm going to now do a divider. I'm going to use my black. We're going to show you what I'm going to do. We're going to make it cute. We're going to do little hearts. Little divider. And then we're going to make our um, social media box here. So we have our social media. And then we have the end of January 23. And then we have February 23. And then how much we've gained. We're going to draw a line. So we have YouTube. We have Instagram. And we have Facebook group. So we are going to draw a line. And a line. Yeah, another line. And we are. My not straight lines here. Anyway, that works. Then we're going to do another little. Whatever it's called. <laughs> Why my brain is not working, I do not know. Divider. So cute. I guess we're going to leave in this one. Okay. So now, let's see what I have. So we are going to do the um, completed pages. Um, how many coloring books I colored in? How many buddy colors? How many challenges? And prompts. How many untouched books I colored in? Um, how many Disney pages? And then we're gonna do some stickers over here. Let's see. February needs one of these red hearts on either side. And then right here, what do I have? I guess I could do a bunch of these. I kind of like these. What do you guys think? I like these. Hmm. Well, let's 
see. It's like a little stamp. And then for some little hearts in the corner. There, it's cute. So there it is. My February is complete. So starting here. We have our calendar, which is I keep track of when I work, uh, when I have the baby, and when I post videos. Um, my completed pages. Then we have my buddy colors. I do four pages. Challenges and prompts, I do four pages. My daddy buttons, bingo. And then I have three notes pages. And then my end of the month wrap up. Yep, so there's February for you. Um, I know there's a lot of you out there that are doing coloring journals now with me. So I hope um, you had fun working in this with me. And I would do the whole year and get it ready. I don't do that in case I need more pages. Um, so I have room. So I leave the washi tapes that, that I use nearby and yeah so I don't know this sticker doesn't want to stay so we shall see we shall see anyway thank you for joining me um I hope you liked it if you're not already subscribed please subscribe to my channel hit the bell button that, so that you're notified when I post new videos and the thumbs up that you liked it I really appreciate it and I know I was asking about tv shows and I never finished that conversation um but it, yeah, if you could list some of your favorite TV shows that you like to watch, I'm looking for some new ones to binge watch. Um, I would appreciate it. And also, let me know in the comments below if you do a coloring journal. I would love to know. And um, if there is anything you think I should add to mine. That's another thing I would like to know. But um, I also wanted to, actually before I end this, um, a little bonus here at the end. I wanted to show you guys my planner really fast. Um, I used to do this way back when. Actually, not that long ago. I did it up until when my mom got sick, and then I couldn't keep up. Because I wasn't living at home. I was living down south, and I didn't have all my stuff with me. And I didn't want to have it with me, though it would have been nice because, you know, we had appointments after appointments and I had to keep track. But I had a, a just like a, a, a pen only um, planner. So um, my grandma gets me this planner every year for Christmas. I didn't get one this year because I didn't use last year's. So I thought um, I can get a new cover that says 2023. I know this is, says 2022. This is Megan's life. And then I think I'm just going to cut this off where it says 2122. Um, because it has, well, I guess I don't, I like this page though. So maybe what I'll do is cut it off and then glue these two pages together. Because I don't need the that calendar. Because I like to use this. Um, at what I've used this before in the past was for like weight loss. So I'd put each month and I'd put like um, how much I weighed at the beginning of the month and how much I lost. You know, it's some type of goal type of thing. So I'm not really sure what I'm going to do. So um, you're going to see some of my life here. <laughs> so here is January. Let me show you what a month looks like that hasn't been done. This is what it looks like. So it's completely blank to begin with. And this is the neutral planner, which is what I like because then you, they have the colorful, a neutral, and I believe they now have a floral one. Um, I like the neutral because I like to decorate it myself. And these are sticker kits that you can purchase. Um, I tend to purchase all printable ones now I, or ones that I already have used and I have created my own. This one I did purchase. This is a Care Bears one. Um, this is from Planner Pixie Co. on Etsy. 
she also has a YouTube channel, which I will um, put in the my description box below. And she does where you can purchase her kits and she can mail them to you, already printed, or you can download them and print them out yourself. And I just print them out on sticker paper. And then I have a silhouette portrait. Um, and the way you print them out, it's set up for your silhouette so that you can cut them out. There are other people out there that have them if you have a Cricut, or you can just cut stuff out yourself, which I did at the beginning. But now I, I use my silhouette. Anyway, so I just re-numbered all the um, days so that it's for 2023, not 2022. So here's my month. Um, I had these. I was going to put goals on here and check them off as I did them. Um, I did not end up doing that. And then here, um, I was keeping track of my coloring books that I purchased in the month. And then my videos. And then that's the week. So I go week by week. And um, so this is my sidebar over here. I like to keep track. I'm... My New Year's resolution was to go to bed by midnight and get up um, no later, no earlier, no later than 9.30 because my bedtime schedule is awful. I'm going to be honest. Here's an honesty moment. I tend to go to bed around 2 to 3 in the morning and get up around 11 or 12 the next day. Not when I'm working, when I'm nannying. I don't do that. But, um... So that's what that is. Um, I do a scavenger hunt with Amanda Colors on our Facebook group, Color With Us. It's a lot of fun. Love for you to join us. Um, we do weekly scavenger hunt. So we have a weekly word, um, which for this week it was bugs. And then um, starting the new year, I'm doing a Disney scavenger hunt also. So we have a weekly word and a weekly Disney character. So it was Wendy from Peter Pan on this uh, week. And then I... I keep track of my meals and then it's just my day as how it goes. It's kind of like, um, fun, like a memory planner kind of a thing. And it helps me like, as far as cleaning schedules, I'm trying to get better with that. So this is my second week. Uh, this is the week I was in Vegas. Well, I went this weekend. So this is this, this week. So as you can see, um, I'm behind. I kind of memory plan is what I do. Um, sometimes I like to plan my whole week out, but it doesn't always happen that way. And this week, because I was in Vegas, I didn't get home till Tuesday night. I didn't know what my week was going to look like for the rest of the week. So, so yep. And then I have next week's ready to go, which I will have all filled out and ready. And then um, I have my February kit purchased. I just need to print it and uh, cut it. Uh, I'm using a gnome one. It's really cute. But, yeah, and these are all sticker kits. Um, different companies, though. I'm not sure which one. I believe this is Planner Pixie Co. This one I know is for sure. This one was a kit that was mailed to me. I don't remember who by. This is Planner Pixie Co. But yes, she has a lot of Disney kits. I have some that I put in my cart. She has an up one I really want. Um forget what the other one is. I don't know if it's Moana. Anyway. But yeah. So I just wanted to show that to you. So if you would like me to continue to add this onto my uh, February setup and show you what my previous month looked like. I would do that. I'm not going to set this one up with you all on uh, camera though, because this one takes me a really long time because I like my stickers to be straight and whatnot. And yeah, this is a coloring channel, not a planner channel. So anyway, those were my planners. And like I said before, I hope you enjoyed this. And don't forget to subscribe. Um, and I love talking to you all and sharing my life with you. Even though you probably don't want to hear some of it. 
<laughs> Sorry. Anyway, I look forward to talking to you all again soon. Bye.